Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try one of these Skyline Chili Bean Burritos. Um, I've tried the Skyline Chili, this is Cincinnati's famous. But the deal is, I think they put a little bit of the cinnamon in their chili. The cinnamon, I mean, uh, Cincinnati adds a little cinnamon to it. So, it's just different. It has a different flavor to it. So, um, anyway, I've tried the Skyline, the meals, like the, the chili bowls and stuff. I've tried those on my channel, so if you're interested in that, you can look them up. Uh, this one is actually a bean burrito. It says it contains uh, flavored with Skyline chili with beef and textured vegetable protein. Mmm, lovely vegetable protein. Um, they bought these at Meyer. They were $1.89 a piece, which is too off of that, I guess. I mean, it's not a dollar burrito, but, you know, not bad. 280 calories for the whole thing, and uh, I'm assuming Tammy had a better picture of that. I don't know. It's whatever. You can uh, pull out of there whatever you can. I don't know that you can see any of that stuff. Um, let's see. How do you cook this thing? Okay, so you can do it in the oven if you want to. You can do it. You can bake it in the oven. You can, um, for a crisp burrito, remove the burrito from the plastic wrapper and put it in the microwave. Say, play here. Let's stand for that. Okay. And for a softer burrito, I usually like mine a little softer. So. So we're going to um, open, cut the end of the wrapper, uh, microwave on high for two to two and a half minutes. I'll probably just do two. Um, add additional time if you need to. Let it sit for two minutes, and the wrapper will be hot. So what's the difference in the crispy one? The crispy one you do two and a half minutes. Um, oh, you remove it from the wrapper if you want it a little crisper. So I'm going to leave it in there because I like my a little soft. I don't like the kind of hard burrito uh, shell. So yeah, I'll be able to. So here's what it looks like. You can see it through the plastic. Typical burrito. I'm going to get this on a paper plate and uh, put it in, in the microwave and I'll be back. Okay, here it is out of the microwave. All I did was cut the wrapper open and cut it in half just so I could show you what it looks like inside. Um, Skyline chili seems to, tends to be a little um, a runnier chili with a very fine uh, grain hamburger. So... Um, or ground beef. So anyway, this is what it looks like. I'm probably gonna cut it in smaller pieces even so it'll be easier to eat. Normally just pick it up and eat it. For a video, it's a little easier to eat in pieces. So anyway, I'll be back when it cools off. Okay, I think it's had some time to cool off. So normally I would not eat a burrito with a fork, but this one I cut it, it really just made a mess. It went everywhere. You can see how runny um, runny it is. So I mean it ran literally all over the let me see if I can hold on to it. It ran all over the top and everything. So anyway, here we go. Flavor's not bad. It has some spice to it, like heat spice. It burns the back of your throat a little bit. Wasn't expecting that. I was expecting it to be um, a pretty mild chili. It's a little spicy. I kind of like it, but, it's, but it, is, it does have some burn to it. Um, try one off the end. The, um, it's all very smooshy. It's, there's no real texture in there. Yeah, the, the only texture you're getting is really from the actual tortilla itself. The actual inside of the filling is all just runny, uh, runny stuff. Even like right there, it looks like a bean and some meat. It's very, very soft. Um, it's like there's no meat in it, honestly. I know it's a meat bean burrito, and maybe it's not. Maybe there's no beef in it. I didn't actually look at the ingredients to see. It doesn't say a beef and bean, so... I'm going to take that back. There is no beef in it. Um, it's just the beans. But the beans, it's all like a very thin pureed um, mush. There's no uh, there's no solids in this at all. My guess is they've taken the, the bean burrito and mixed it in with their chili spice, which make, gives it that, that seasoning. I like the flavor of it. Um, like I said, it does have that little touch of cinnamon, which is not like, ooh, that's cinnamon. Um, it just adds a little bit of different flavor to it. I like the flavor of it. I wish there was more um, solid beans in it and they didn't cook them to death to where they were all just mush. I wish there was more texture to it. But beyond that, I actually like it. I like the flavor of it. I like the uh, um, the texture of the burrito itself. The tortilla itself is really good. Um, if it wasn't for the mushy beans, it would be it would be like really good. So I'm going to give it a three just because I wish it had more uh, texture. I would never give it a five even if it had really good texture. It would be more like a four. But um with it, with it having that really just mushy, runny texture to the inside, um, I'm gonna give it a three. 
Again, the flavors are really good, and if you don't mind that really soft texture on the inside, then you'll be fine with it. So you you uh, you should try it out. So I think it's good. I'm gonna continue to eat it. I'm gonna eat all of it, but um, yeah, it's still a three for me. So I hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching.